Hello guys, today we're looking at how to film outdoors. Hello guys, this video will be about how to film outdoors. Now I thought it would be a little bit adventurous and go out into a deep forest and just show you some of little tips that I've learned personally over the years of how to film outdoors. Now something that is really, really important when you're out about filming, be aware of the sunlight. Make sure you've planned and you've got everything ready. Make sure you've got all the equipment. If you've got your microphone, the right tripod, the right camera for whatever you're doing. And something that I've struggled with, as I've always used point and shoot cameras, is the microphone. Make sure you've got a good microphone connected to your top or an external mic on top of your camera like I have now. It's really important. It's really nice. It picks up all the sounds around you. And it's really nice to hear. And the sound quality is so much better. And just make sure if you do have an external microphone that's got a sponge on it which will block out the wind otherwise if you're say in a field or on top of a hill or just a windy day in general you will get a lot of and when you go back to editing it will be horrible because all you'll get is wind 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 i'm just looking in the uh, screen at the moment just to see so as you can see as i'm turning um the, the light is changing it's adjusting and then you get it just right and that's exactly how you want it you want the sun to be on your face lighting your face perfectly and that gives a really good shot and as you can see you can see things in the background that's really nice as well and it's just perfect because if you don't, don't do it right this is what you'll get you'll get a sort of so imagine you're under the trees and you'll get this sort of dark you know, look and maybe you want that for your film and that's great but if you're just doing a, a video log or you, you want to do a film you want to light the face and you might go, not quite right. So you can see on the screen here, it's not quite as good. Something else to bear in mind is obviously when you're out and about, you may come across people that like to be interested in what you're doing. And most of the time it's pretty cool, but obviously it requires a little bit of waiting. But you know, always gravy, it's all part of the fun. And sometimes you'll get people asking, what are you doing, what are you up to? And that's all part of the adventure, really. Right. So I hope you really enjoyed this little video. I hope some of the tips in the video helps. Don't forget, most importantly, is the sunlight from the sun, which is your best friend when you're out and about. And just make sure you've got a sun mic with a sponge on it, because that will just make your film experience so much easier when you go back to editing. So thank you so much for watching. Do you ever get to uh, like the links, uh, click the links, uh, the playlist on the side of the video. Don't forget to subscribe, share with your friends, watch this video as many times as you want. But most importantly, just thank you for watching. Hope you got something from this video and have, <laughs> have a great day. See, being outdoors. And you can pick up all the sound. Why do I sound out of breath? Probably because I've been doing a lot of running. <laughs> what was that? So basically, the important things you need to remember is lighting. Now, a wood is quite an interesting place to light because on the daylight today, where it's really sunny, you've got the sun shining through. You can probably see it through the trees. If you have a look, look. It's going up through the trees, and I feel like David Attenborough. Now, 